Hey guys, welcome back to the farm. As you just saw from those videos, we moved Josie over. And uh, not sure what day this video will come out, but we moved her over on a Wednesday. And today is actually a Friday. And I uh, came out to feed all the piglets. And she didn't come out, so you guys know what that means. She did end up having her piglets, so we're going to make her way out, our way out here and see her piglets, but we might as well not pass everybody else up. So, look who it is coming first, itty bitty. Piglets are all doing well. Some are getting ready to go to new homes. Hey, everybody. Izzy's piglet, Jesse. I can't remember which one it is. It's one of these white ones. She did not leave, so he's excited about that. I had got that confused and told him that Jesse was leaving, but she isn't. But piglets are all doing good. We've had some rain finally. Can't complain about that. We're getting ready to rake out their spots. We'll open it up a little bit more and give them some more area. How's everybody doing? So everybody is good. I think we have uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14 pigs in here. And they have just been enjoying enjoying themselves so everybody's good check over here at uh sassy's group they should be weaned next week or close to it hey sassy girl just want to say hi she has been loving her wallow piglets are doing good they obviously have been in a wallow too look at this mess getting chocolate milk this morning but they'll be with mama just a little bit longer and then we'll move mama out and move them probably in with those other piglets but i can hear her i can hear josie over there but i'm gonna walk through the front of the barn the last video with the brooders we had lost some chickens we built the new brooders if you haven't seen that check that out here but uh chicks are doing amazing something's still getting in here i've set these traps but it is not going for the traps it took the peanut butter we put peanut butter in the traps took the peanut butter right out of one of the traps but chickens are doing fine i feel like they're safe now this is the trap you can see where it's dug in in that corner there but hasn't been able to get any chickens. So that is a good thing. The brooders are working awesome. We're gonna work on getting this one cleaned out. These guys are about a week away from going outside. So happy with how the brooders have gone. You guys are still lively and crazy, but just a good peace of mind to uh, know that your animals are safe. But what you probably all wanna see is Josie. And she was a first time mama. And like I was saying, I came out this morning and fed. Usually when I'm over here feeding sassies, she's out at the fence checking checking her out. Hey, Jos. She didn't come out, so I assume there was piglets. You're okay, mama. You don't have to get up for us. Good girl. Good girl. So she was in the house still. Hey, little one, you don't have to worry about us. She had five total. Um, I did have to put one down. One was born with some uh, weird front legs. Like they were all bent in, just, just really weird. It couldn't walk, it couldn't get up. It was kind of scooting itself around on the ground. So unfortunately we did have to uh, put that one down, but you know, when something's got a deformity or something like that and we had never seen that before but you don't want to keep making that thing suffer so she's got four healthy are you gonna come over here and eat there you go let's see this one that is the girl so these three are boys you know we've been very girl heavy this year and this is the only girl. The one that I put down was a girl as well. So she had a total of five. She's got the three boys and one girl. So biggest thing, most important thing, they're doing well and mama is doing well. She came out and ate this morning 
and uh, she is doing well. We have talked to people. People ask us about feeding. You never want to up their feed until they have their piglets. Otherwise, those piglets get too big and you have a tough pregnancy. So once they have their piglets and she's starting to nurse, that's when we have upped their feed. So she was getting two cups twice a day. This morning, I gave her six cups. And then we'll just watch her. She doesn't have a ton of piglets, so we'll just watch and see what she needs as these piglets get older and we'll control her feed that way. But dad is Chubbs, our big black boar. And uh, this is Josie, first time mama. So cool colors. I like these. Yeah, you like them all, right? I was going to say I like the spotted one, but I do like this ginger. I like them all. I like them all. So it was nice to get a couple boars. Normally you're excited to get a bunch of females, but we've had so many females. It's been nice, or was nice, to get a couple boars this litter. So as always, I was telling Jamie this morning, she had just left for work and I had come out and fed and tried to call her and she was already gone. But it's sometimes it's nice to... Uh, just come out and the piglets are all doing well. Obviously we had the one not doing well, but placenta was in here. Piglets were all dried off. So she she didn't have them last night at dinner time. We fed probably about four o'clock last night and she was still out eating and everything. So somewhere between four and the morning time, obviously is when she had these piglets, but she's doing well. The barn has been great. Um, and we've got four more healthy healthy little piggies here so happy as always to see new life on the farm but that's about all that's been going on i'm glad isaiah and i were able to get her over here jamie had told us it was coming this weekend and so we got her over here two days before two days before she had the babies but everybody's doing good it's crazy to see these guys almost eight weeks big fat hogs and then you come over here and we're not even a day old yet they look like a little piece of rice they're very skinny when they first come out some of them are longer than the others but two three days maybe four and they start filling out and looking really good so you guys are getting weaned next you'll move in with all the other adolescents and we'll start to give mama a break so she's been a great great sow for us our third litter and she's doing well and guys i always say they're, they're great great mamas and first time mama here so now she's a sow not a guilt anymore she's had her babies we have not had an issue with a sow some are more protective than others but we've never like been worried about them attacking us or anything we're always we're always wary of having our kids come in by themselves with the mama so we're usually out here with them chickens are safe happy about that they'll be going outside here in just a couple of days but life is good been going good on the farm we've been getting some rain now it's hard to keep up with the grass getting mowed i'm gonna need some more grazing animals so i don't have to mow the grass as often but just wanted to give you guys that little update josie's first litter all doing fantastic and then these little fat hogs are all doing fantastic it's just been a really good summer really good pigging season for us and we just just enjoy these coonies so we appreciate you guys following along i've got to unload a ton of feed that's always fun especially when the prices are going through the roof again the prices have gone up but you got to do what you got to do so i'm going to get this feed unloaded hope you guys have a great day remember to make the change we'll see you on the next video